this video is going to be on some trampoline basics. First, when you get on a trampoline and get off a trampoline, you want to walk on and walk off. If you jump on and jump off, you could get hurt. Uh, next, when you're on the trampoline, you want to stay in the middle, usually facing in one direction. One of the most important things on a trampoline is being able to have a stop. Uh, so we're going to practice doing a nice controlled landing. So when you land on a trampoline, you want to bend your knees and use your leg muscles to absorb the landing and land with your stomach tight and back round as your back is important to you. Next, we're just going to bounce a few times, trying to stay in the middle, uh, get comfortable with bouncing, with our arms by our ears, uh, arms nice and straight, arms turned out. Next, we're going to add a backward arm circle, where your arms are going to be up at the top of your jump, and then circle back around like this. Next, we're going to do some basic jumps. There's a tuck jump, a straddle jump, a pike jump, a jump half turn, and a jump full turn. And you can do a jump full turn to the left or to the right. Usually, whichever leg is in front of your cartwheel is the way you're going to twist. Awesome. Thanks, Justin. Uh, next, we're going to do a seat doggy belly, and we're going to do a reach position. First, there's a seat drop. We're going to land on your legs with your legs straight, hands by your sides right here. Uh, hands not this way. You can hurt your elbows. Palms facing this way. And then there's a doggy drop. We're going to land on your hands with your arms straight, knees bent, and your back nice and rounded so your back is flat or horizontal to the trim. From this doggy, we're going to open up flat and do a stomach drop, landing with our hands here and our knees bent uh, nice and flat on your stomach. We're not going to dive forward either. Wherever our feet are, we're going to jump back a tiny bit so our hips or belly button land where our feet were. Something else we're doing with tramp is seat doggy forward roll. First we're going to go over the forward roll a tiny bit. We're going to bend down, you're going to do the tramp, make sure that you support your weight on your arm. So we're going to look at that roll. You can also break this down if you see the stand up forward roll. You can also turn it into seat doggy and flip a little bit. And do one where you actually flip all the way to your feet. That's awesome. 